Good day, my name is Dr. David Evans. I'm the founder of VectorVision and the inventor of the CSV2000, our newest product. Thank you for joining us today for this video. Today we're gonna to discuss the functionality of the CSV2000. The CSV2000 is the first fully automated digital acuity and contrast sensitivity testing system that is fully standardized. The automated calibration technology ensures standardization not only for visual acuity testing, but also for contrast sensitivity ensuring standardized results. The device automatically measures a light level and calibrates to a specific standard. The CSV2000 standardization is powered by a newly patented technology called AccuVis. As you can see, the instrument is calibrating now. AccuVis automatically calibrates the device when it's not in use to ensure a standardized vision testing light level of 85 candelas per meter squared. The CSV2000 offers a full range of vision tests in a standardized format. From ETDRS testing, to standard Sloan acuity, to children testing, to color testing, to astigmatism, and many more. All easily controlled by remote control. The functionality of the remote control can be found on page 17 of our product manual. The CSV2000 is also offered with a standardized glare source, shown here. The glare light levels initiate at the level recommended by the FDA for simulating two oncoming headlights and glare disability. The CSV2000 also offers a real-world driving scene under low contrast conditions, which helps to educate patients and relatives of patients what it means to have vision loss in a low contrast environment. The CSV2000 offers the proprietary contrast sensitivity test from Vector Vision. The test is very easy to administer. When administering the test, simply show the contrast sensitivity gratings on the screen and ask the patient, Mrs. Jones, can you see the stripes under the letter A. Yes, I can. Okay, now under number one, are the stripes in the top circle or the stripes in the bottom circle? Oh, they're in the top. Number two, bottom. Number three, top. Number four, top, etc. Once the patient has completed level four contrast sensitivity, switch to the next range of contrast sensitivity five through eight, asking the same questions. Are the stripes in the top or the stripes in the bottom? If the patient is having difficulty seeing the stripes, then offer a third choice, both blank top, bottom, or both blank. Contrast sensitivity should be tested across all four rows. Row A, row B, row C, and row D. After the patient has taken the test, please visit the other video on our website entitled, How to Test and Record Contrast Sensitivity Results. Thank you again for viewing this video about the functionality of the CSV2000. If you have any further questions about the CSV2000, please feel free to contact us.